Hi Rubies, hope you're well today. Thank you for checking out today's video. Um, so today I thought I could share with you some of my favourite apps. Um, just thought it might be interesting to share. I'd also love to know some of your favourite apps. Um, just why not? So, okay, this is my new phone, new-ish now. Uh, this is the iPhone 12 mini. I did do like a whole review and thoughts and stuff on this video over on my gaming channel. Okay, let's start with, at the top here, I've got the widgets um, kind of stack, um, which is really, really helpful. I use it a lot, to be honest. It's a new feature in um, iOS 14. Um, and I tend to leave it on this bit here, which is um, from the Mindful app here. Don't worry, by the way. Let me just, sorry, turn this down. Don't worry, by the way, um, I don't always have everything open like this. I'm one of these people that I do have to close out of something as soon as I finish with it. So it's kind of stressing me out having this many open. But it's just so I know what to show you. Um, and this app is free. Um, and you can just scroll through and choose different quotes. So I just leave it on that just for a bit of inspiration and just to feel good. So my next... Um, favorite app is the notes app um i know that sounds kind of strange to, to include this but genuinely i use it so so much i've actually now organized it into different areas of my life which has been really helpful because before it was just a jumble now the notes bit is just my general stuff so the things i use daily so i log my food um i just have some nice quotes that i like that need adding to i just have my schedule of what i need to do that day what else i have stuff about my life statement uh, power questions to think about this is from my law of attraction planner um, and just every day I do the morning questions and the evening questions um, daily affirmations um, just stuff like that and then just different areas of my life so that is the notes app that is incredibly helpful and again it's something I have stacked here in the widget thing because I use it so often so next up <laughs> obviously I'm I do use my calendar quite a lot as well Ever since I've used it as part of the widget, I do use it a lot more because um, it obviously it shows up there on the the left where it says no more events today. It will show up things that are going on, so that's quite helpful. What next do I have? Next up is my Kindle app. I do use that quite a lot at the moment. I am reading Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill because I have a Kindle Unlimited um, subscription. I'll just show you some of the books I've got. At the moment, I've got a bunch of samples to read from the Kindle Unlimited that I haven't really looked at. Uh, Linda Thompson, Little Thing Called Life, Michael J. Fox. Um, what else? I have a lot of samples, to be honest with you, that I still need to read. Uh, You're a Badass. Um, Elton John, My Sister Millie. What else? Extreme Transformation, Columbine, A Mother's Reckoning. That's a, Oh, no, that's not that one. That's that one. Down here, A Mother's Reckoning. That's a really uh, powerful book. Mercury and Me, Jim Hutton, How to Be a Victorian. Uh, yeah, you get the idea. I've got loads. Um, so that's the Kindle app. I really enjoy having that on my phone. Um, so next up, I have Spotify. Obviously, I use that a lot. I have it in um, my widget up there. Um, I did just actually do a video on my music channel um if you want to check it out going through all the kind of the songs i listen to oh gosh this is um literally my memos next to my notes app it's probably my most used app honestly ever it's i use it for all my songs ideas i won't really play any of it at the moment because it's a lot of it's stuff i'm working on um but literally pretty much any song i ever do goes through the the, the voice notes app at some point whether that's at the beginning when I'm still kind of trying to work it out or towards the end when I just want to kind of hear it back. Pretty much every song I ever do goes through that app and it's just incredible. Um, what else have I got? I have the Calm app, which I find very useful. Um, we have the Daily Calm. You've got Sleep Stories. How Are You Feeling? I use a lot. Um, and what I do is I, I pair it with my Notes app. Um, all my power questions over here. And I'll fill it, fill all this in and I'll just copy and paste it pretty much to my how are you feeling so I can look back and see, you know, how I'm feeling each day and the things that I've been thinking about that day and what I've done, etc. 
and then this is just my screen you can you can choose different ones um but yeah this is the one i like and i did have that one for a while with the rain but at the moment i'm liking this one so that is the calm app i really love that you can actually get seven days free premium membership um and then it's if you like it it's 28 pound a year which i think is really worth it i will post my link in the description below where you can get 30 days premium membership by following my link not sponsored it's just you know helpful to share um what else have i got i have obviously my audible app which i use a lot i always listen to audible when i go to sleep um usually it's harry potter to be honest i've got a couple of the harry potter ones but i do have some other ones in here i do also have an audible membership as well so i've got quite a few of the free podcasts in there too but yeah harry potter is like i listen to that every single night to go to sleep um so that's audible next obviously i just really like reddit um i find it i mean maybe it's just the things i follow but i find it less toxic than some of the other platforms because you know i just follow things that i really like i follow a lot of positive stuff i follow animal crossing harry potter just stuff that makes me happy um and you know it's just i like scrolling through reddit it's usually a really kind of positive place for me i don't ever comment it's just i like to you know read what other people are saying next up i've got the layout app which is for instagram um and you can just create easy collages in your phone um i think it might even have some editing oh no i need to change my settings but yeah anyway i use that quite a lot to you know put photos together if i just want it under the one post this is my Qatar tuna app i just use the free part of it you can um pay i think to um to like unlock other instruments and stuff but i just use the free one and it's just for the guitar and it's just really really easy to use um if for whatever reason my tuna on my guitar is not working or i've forgotten an external one um i just really like that so that's that one uh then i've got couch to 5k i've used this a few times as you can see i've completed it um and i just think if you're interested in running this is a really really great tool it's free uh it's from the nhs i believe and um it's just really really helpful they start you off nice and slow and you just build up to running for half an hour three times a week by the end of nine weeks and genuinely i thought it was impossible for me to do that but i've completed it three times now and it is definitely possible and they build it up nicely so yeah i recommend that one and then the last one is diner dash this is the only game i'm going to mention because i don't really tend to play a lot of games on my phone anymore i just ugh, i just deleted most of them in the end because i just didn't bother i don't actually know if you can still get this one or not but if you can diner dash is great and again this is free I will just quickly show you like what you have to do. I'm not going to play much of it because that will be boring. Um, but I don't know if you recognise this. You kind of just pop them in. You get them some drinks. You take their order. Anyway, yeah, you get the idea. You kind of take their order. You serve it. Blah, blah, blah. Um, and I think that's pretty much it, to be honest, of all, anything I wanted to mention. Um so yeah they are my favorite apps i hope you enjoyed my video have a great day i would love to know your favorite apps and i will see you later bye rubies